So thank you everybody for coming. We, we first thought to make the meeting in Portuguese, but we are now making it in English so everybody can, can, can be a part of it. So thank you everybody for coming here in Sao Paulo and there in Boston. Thank you very much Andresa and Marina for making it happen there in, there in Boston, the breakfast and everything in the last moment. Thank you. So we have a, a brief agenda that we, we would like to cover. So it's a very fast meeting. And we are thinking about uh, talking about introducing ourselves. So the, the objectives of this meeting are about for us to know each other and the programs that we have here at uh, Lemon Fellow Foundation related to the medical science chapter of the Lemon Fellows. And uh, for us to show, to give back to Lemon Foundation and also to the society the results that we have. So right now we send to all of you to your, to your emails uh, uh, yesterday, a PDF with the University of Sao Paulo uh, New Frontiers in Internationalization. We think that we have here, as Lemon Fellows, something to add to this University of Sao Paulo and Science Without Fron Frontiers and other initiatives that we have here in Brazil right now. So we think that making this know-how that we have is going to have help at least for the University of Sao Paulo and then we can uh, also help other initiatives uh, by other universities. So the agenda for today is we, we are introducing ourselves for us to know each other. The object of the meeting is this, for us to know each other. So most of us are uh, used Harvarders, so uh, we already know, but sometimes we don't know the people that are older or younger, so it's good for us to know each other better. And uh, also we have here uh, people that are from uh, MP Asian professors. So we are introducing ourselves and then we have a, uh, a brief uh, seminar by uh, Ricardo Terra and then a brief seminar by Professor Saldiva and then we are having a, a fact sheet uh, production so we would, we will divide ourselves maybe here in, in Sao Paulo in two groups and you there in Boston is up to you if you want to divide in one group or two groups and we are just discussing what we've learned uh, about our program, so what we have as experience that can be used by, by other programs. And uh, in the end we will close uh, with, a, with a brief presentation by a representative uh, from each group and uh, then we will we'll close the meeting. So um, we, we, can, we can start by, by, by our introduction, so I always start my introduction. So the idea is uh, a brief introduction about we know about ourselves and uh, about what we want to do for the future. So, um, the programs that we have here at Lemon Foundation are three of them. Four of them, in fact. So, there, there's the Lemon Cardiovascular Research Fellows at Harvard Medical School. So, it's a two year post graduate post graduation program there at uh, uh, Ma Harvard Medical School. And Marina maybe can talk a little more about this. Then we have the Lemon uh, FMU, the Harvard School of Public Health Fellows at uh, most of us, the USP Harvarders, that we, 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 we stay for one year doing research at, uh, at the Department of Environmental Health and other departments at the HSPH. And then we have a program that is the USP uh, Ribeirão Preto EAU Research Training Program in Infectious Disease. So this program is a short period program for infectious disease um, uh, training at, at Yale. And we try to contact these people there uh, at uh, USP uh, Ribeirão, but uh, maybe we have just Rafael França, is, is he over here, over there in Boston? I'm not sure. So we try to contact these people, but we don't have, do not have people from this USP Harvard uh, Research Bureau here in the meeting today, but we want to, to contact in the next ones. So Lemon Fellowship Talent Program. So we have these four programs, and. Um, uh, I'll introduce myself and start a, a brief introduction. So my name is Lucas. Uh, I stay in their environmental health department uh, doing research with uh, Joseph Brain, doing research about pharmacokinetics of zinc. Now I'm the fourth year of medical school. I stopped the medical school last year to start some projects related to what I like that is uh, basically a, a health, uh, in, digital health solution for you to have your exams put together in the internet in the same place. So I'm working with it, it's called Carterina.org, and this is what I'm interested in, medicine and the management related to health. So, Hi, Fernanda, I'm a third year medical school, uh, 
uh, called student, sorry, and I went to a just PH. I stayed in the Shore Lab for one year last year. And I guess that's it. Hi, I'm Natasha. I'm a first year residency in pediatrics now. I went to Boston in 2009, uh, hosted by Professor Bilesky and Professor Bayer. Um, I also did some research at Children's Hospital. And uh, my plans for the future, um, I'm just taking my staff test in the US. I just did the last one in January, and I'm waiting on the results. Um, my name is Liana. I was there last year working with Professor John Butleski. And <laughs> <laughs> um, we, we did some research on the changes in blood flow regarding exposure to air pollution. And this year I might start an epigenetics pro project on uh, transplant rejection in children. And I don't know what I'm going to do in the future, but I hope it will be bright. I'm Eladio. I, I also work on Jungle West Laboratory with the uh, on pollution studies as well. Now I'm a third year medical student. And I'm now engaged in some HIV studies regarding the vaccines last year. Good morning, everybody here. And Can you hear us? Just double checking. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, thank yes. you. Uh, I, I was in Boston in 2011, hosted by Dr. Uh, uh, Kozik. Uh, uh, so I was working on uh, lung post defense against pneumonia, viral, and bacteria. Uh, as for officially, I uh, entered uh, a program in the uh, Graduate School of Education in Harvard. Uh, so these are my interests. I uh, clearly want to be a doctor and a case. My name is Hanyo. I was there last year. I was in a kind of wrestler lab under the supervision of Dr. Peter Lee in the same lab as my studies. And I was doing some research about atherosclerosis and thrombosis. And now I'm a fourth year medical student and I'm also doing some research also in the field of cardiology. Uh, my name is Tim Linden. I'm, uh, I graduated from Harvard College in May and now I'm working down here with the Dr. Class office. I know some people in the group. I'm hoping to, to meet the rest and be helpful in whatever way possible. Uh, my name is Ricardo. I'm a professor at University of São Paulo. I work at the uh, cardiopneumology department. And I was uh, at the MPH program last year. I finished it last year. And now I'm developing some projects on uh, implementing innovations in thoracic oncology and some studies in education in medicine. Uh, hi, I'm Dennis Misny. Uh, I'm a neurosurgeon. Uh, no, uh, I'm a lawyer, but that's boring. Uh, I'm the director of the Lemon Foundation. Uh, so it's a, it's a pleasure to host you all here and in Boston. The next meeting, we'll find a way to exchange the food we're eating, just to see how it works. Uh, it's uh, just, I mean, on, on behalf of the foundation, we are, the, the Lemon Foundation never thought it had a focus in health. But then slowly, we were discovering that several of our, the programs that we were either supporting with others or, you know, uh, managing ourselves were related to uh, health sciences. As uh, Lucas said in the beginning, today we have four programs uh, in this area from undergraduates as the majority of you but also uh, in the, at the master's level and also at the postdoctoral level in cardiovascular uh, and we have this other undergraduate program in this collaboration between Yale and University of Sao Paulo Ribeirão and 
And now we think that this is going to increase even further with the collaborations that the Lemon Foundation has established with Science Without Borders, uh, in the way that we're helping COPPES to establish Science Without Borders in the six universities we currently partner with, so Harvard, Yale, Columbia, uh, Stanford, Illinois, and UCLA. And in all those six universities, I believe, uh, there will be uh, scholarships on the health sciences. Um, so we're adapting to this, and we were very, very happy uh, to be able to support this initiative that is not our initiative, it's an initiative of Lucas and all of you that decided to make this group and put them together and go beyond not only the USP Harvarders, uh, but also to include uh, the other uh, groups involved in, in health. So we're, I mean, just happy to be here and to facilitate in any way. What we strongly believe is that, and what Jorge Paulo strongly believes, is that good people together will come up with interesting things. And I think that's what we're already, just listening by the introductions of this side of the table, uh, we are already very excited to think about what this, this can lead into the future. And you probably most of you all know the team at the Lemon Foundation working with our talent program, but they can Hi, introduce everyone. themselves. Hello, I'm Camila. I'm a project manager here at the Lemon Foundation. I know some of Camila, you. Camila, sorry. We can see you. If you could just one take one a one step. She's a little, uh, she's okay. a little small. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think it was Thank because you. of that. <laughs> so I'm a project manager here at the Foundation. I know some of you. I had the pleasure to meet Professor Godleski last year. Uh, and we are happy to facilitate this meeting, as Denis just said, and we are happy to work with you in any initiatives you have. Um, hi, I'm Anna. I'm Projects Coordinator here at the Lemon Foundation. So we're happy to host you, and I'm also responsible for the Science Without Borders uh, project inside of the Lemon Foundation. So everything that we're doing to support increasing the number of Brazilian students in our six partner universities, um, I'm making efforts to, to make this happen, so I think this meeting is very valuable okay. for us to make this happen even more. So thank you. Now we have the full team here. So, if you... Uh, uh, would like to introduce over you there, so then we can know you better. <laughs> uh, my name is Julio. I am uh, a student from the program at USP and Harvard. And I think we are the first students of the Association Between Science Without Borders and this program. And I'm in the lab with Dr. Weger, doing cardiology. And my future plans are pretty simple, just be a doctor and maybe bring the research knowledge that I have here to Brazil. So my name is Marina. I am a research fellow at Brigham and Women's Hospital at Dr. Peter Leibniz's lab. I'm working there for almost a year now. I have to say, I'll try not to get emotional, but I'm ha very happy to see you guys again. <laughs> and <it's very> much. <laughs> um, so this program that I'm in is directed specific, sorry, specifically for cardiovascular research, either uh, to be conducted by MDs, PhDs, or MD, PhDs, which is my case here. Um, it has been a great opportunity to get a, a deeper insight into how science is, science is thought and is conducted here in America, and I think this is probably the most precious knowledge I'm going to take from uh, Boston, and also the experience in the environment, I think, for researchers uh, here is also of great value. So, yes, I'm also working with inflammation and atherosclerosis. I'm doing basic research. And I think that's, oh, I graduated uh, as an MD from, um, in 2010, Universidad Federal de Rio do Sul. And I, my PhD I finished in 2012 with focusing hypertension and um, retinal image. So I'm interested in, generally I'm interested in biomarkers and I intend to work uh, with translational medicine and biomarkers in the future. I am Rodolfo, uh, me, Julio, and Anna, we are working 
working at Professor Steiger Laboratory. We are currently working in combination of drugs in atrial fibrillation and as a medical student as well in a community. And yeah, my, 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 my plans for the future are becoming a doctor as well. That's all. So my name is Felipe, I'm working with short lab. So we are studying the effects of pills on exposure in months most of the time. And as Kelly said, that's been an experience here. And it's really cool to be inside one of the greatest universities of America and the world. So it's been really good to be here in Boston. That's a really good city and Harvard also. Hi, my name is Luca and I'm working in epigenetics. Uh, more specifically, cadmium exposure in Gazarka's lab. And I'm really excited to be here, and I hope uh, this year will be great. Hi, I'm Andressa. I'm working on Brain's lab. Our major project is related to inhaled insulin. And as everybody just said, I'm really glad to be here this year. I think it's a great opportunity. Hey, so Hi, I'm John Gillespie, and uh, I think I've met most of you somewhere along the way. It's great to see you all again. And, uh, of course, I'm uh, on the faculty here at the School of Public Health, as well as uh, the medical school in Brigham and Women's Hospital. And uh, my area of expertise is pathology, and uh, I study air pollution and uh, the health effects of uh, traffic-related pollution on the cardiovascular system. My name is Paulo Saldiva, professor of pathology as well, like John, and I'm uh, very happy to be here. Thank you very much. And you're called all day, right? You too. <laughs>